Hey NWA Mountain State fans, I'm Jessica Schuler. Join us on October 7th to see Stroh versus Pierce, showdown number two. The NWA World's Heavyweight title is on the line. We're doing everything he can here. He hooks the other arm now. 30 seconds. 30 remaining. seconds, Rockstar. 30 seconds. So doing everything he can to tear Adam Pierce in half. He he's worked on the neck. He's worked on the rotator cuff. 20 seconds. He's trying to stop him. 20 seconds, Rockstar. He is stretching the world heavyweight champion. Laying the elbows in less than 20 seconds of the match. Ten All the hooks in West yes. Virginia. Nine, the line eight, here. seven, Quick six, six five, on, five, four, four, three, he's two, on to one. The match is the match. Ring the bell. It's the bell. It's the bell. It's the This is a singular opportunity in a man's life to do something the right way. I've looked in a mirror and I've been given one last opportunity. It is not only my pledge to you at home but to myself, to my family, to the National Wrestling Alliance. I will be, I will be, the definition of the word champion. I will be unwavering. I will leave no stone unturned, no challenge unanswered. The first time that Scrap Baron Adam Pierce and Stro, the Meister of Wrestling, stepped in the ring for the NWA World Heavyweight Championship. It was epic. It was a classic. 45 minutes straight through. And you tapped out to the cross face right after the bell rang. So close. Regardless, it was, it was a moment. It was history. Hats off to you, Adam Pierce. Mutual respect, much respect for what you've accomplished being the NBA World Heavyweight Champion. Since then, a lot of things have happened. You got injured, lost the NWA World Heavyweight Championship, and there are critics out there saying, the naysayers saying that you would never come back to a pro wrestling ring, much less regain the NWA World Heavyweight Championship. But you did. I was there. The Ohio State Fair. You went out there with three of the NWA's finest and reclaimed that prize. You proved all the doubters wrong. See, in this pro wrestling business, you can't train somebody to be a champion. Either it's in you or it's not. Just like if it's in you to be a pro wrestler or it's not. You can't just watch TV one day and say, I'm going to be a wrestler, and then the very next day, hey, I'm in the ring, I'm a wrestler, I'm a star, I'm wearing makeup. I'm the man, I'm the woman. I'm the, the upper echelon of pro wrestling. What you do, you pay your dues. You drive up and down the roads, you travel up and down the country, you travel around the world, you learn from the veterans, you get experience night after night, whether you're 100% whether you're injured, you go out there and you perform. No matter what, you learn from the best to be the best. And Adam Pierce, you are a champion. You are the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. And of course, I have my doubters. You know, I've been hurt before, I've been injured before. I've come close to being out of the pro wrestling industry business. But I keep coming. And I keep coming. And I keep coming back and doing it time and time again. Just like the old saying uh, about the story of David and Goliath. Well, no one thought David had a chance against the almighty Goliath. But he took him out. He took him down. With what? A pebble. A little rock. My rock is, Adam Pierce, my little rock is my faith. My faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. That little rock also represents everybody that stuck behind me and believed in me, whether it was colder like me or not, for year after year. 
that little rock represents everybody that was told in their life they can't but they do they keep on doing come October 7th Adam Pierce I'm gonna do it again and this time around Stro the Maestro of Wrestling will be the NWA World Heavyweight Champion ooh la la